Steward. Hello, my name is Desarde. I'm the legate of the merchant congregation. May I enter? Good day, legate Desarde. No, this building is closed to Renaixe. I am Siora, daughter of Vladne, daughter of Meb. My mother, the Mal of the Red Spears, was a member of the council. All here remember, and the Vorst Tirse. She was a courageous Mal. But you are not yet Mal in her stead, and you do not carry her seal. I am sorry, Siora. I cannot allow you to enter. I beg your pardon. I did not know.
Here is the seal of the Denegad Katasach, of the village of Wenshavie. And so you are a trusted friend of the great healer. He must see your true face and find it worthy. Enter. You are welcome. I give you warm greetings, Glendan. I am Desardé, legate of the Congregation of Merchants. Your merchant congregation sways me very slightly from my part. But you are a current of Katasach. His trust in you makes me stop and look at you. What brings you here? I seek a remedy. My cousin, as well as many other people on our island, suffer from a terrible sickness. We think that only Enon Miel Frichtemann can help us find a cure. Really? And Katasach sent you to see me? He told me that the only way to meet with your god was to come and see you. You would judge our worthiness. Judge your intentions? Yes, that I can do. But even if I should do this, you would have many trials to pass. For the path you seek to follow has only been tread but a very few times, and you are the first Renaixe to set foot upon it. We must begin where everything begins. There is a trial, the trial of water. It will show us the reflection of your soul. What must I do? You must go to a cavern and tell me what you see on the seal you will find deep in its center. And this cavern is guarded, I suppose. That is true. But the simplest solution is not always the best. It is a path with many forks. I hope you will prove that you understand the spirit of our people and our island. Go now. Show us your true face and return purified by the waters of the cavern. What can you tell me about the sanctuary? It is the most sacred place of the island. The hidden face, and still seen by all of you. En all mil frichtemen. I protected these doors like my father before me and his father before him. And still none of us have ever entered. Am I to gather that there has never been a high king in your family? We are heads of the Council of Kings. And so it is prohibited for us to present ourselves. We must remain impartial. I see. And so you cannot speak to me about what you find inside? The heart of the island beats near here, the volcano. And I know that it is a place full of life. What can you tell me about your god? That the word god is too small to hold him. He is Tiafradi in all and everything. The wisdom of his people, the gentleness of his rivers, the strength of his volcano. You are looking for wisdom to heal the Renaixe, but you still see it with the eyes of a sort of Donegat. He is much more than that. He is the essence of all life, of all magic, the spring. Can you tell me anything more about the role of the Council? We gather here at every long night, and every short night. During these nights, the clans are in disagreement and come here looking for wisdom of the Council, and of course also the High King. Those who have complaints against their Mal may also be heard here, and find justice. And when important events take place, if the balance is threatened, then we also meet here so that the wisdom of all might be shared, and that we might act as the same people. I must leave. Goodbye. Kwa awelem seg. You have spoken to Glendon as you wanted. What more can I do for you?
I was asked to pass the trial of water. What do you know about it? I have never passed it. Only those who must reveal their soul walk this path. The High Kings and Queens. It is a tremendous honor given to you, Renaixe. Do you have any advice to give me? I only know that the trial can be passed in many ways, and your choice will reveal the makings of your soul. One way is through strength, the other by ruse and heart. But I know no more than this. The trials are kept secret. Anything else? Nothing else, thank you. I need to leave. Good luck. And do not lose yourself in your own reflection. Karantz, I need to talk to you. I have to ask you for another favor. I'm listening, Siora. Do you remember the mind shakers in my village? Yes. If I understand correctly, there was some kind of an agreement made with them. Even though these priests would make good allies against the lions because they hate them as much as we do, my mother would never have traded the spirits of the people of the village in exchange for their help. And she would have wanted to be buried according to our rituals. She was deeply attached to our traditions. So you think that they're lying? Yes. And you understand these Renaixe better than I do. But... I see that you are already busy with something else. So could you come back once you have time? Anything else? I must pass the trial of water. Do you know anything about it? I have heard it talked about. It is a trial that all must pass if they wish to become the High King. One says that the trial reveals the true personality of those who pass it. My mother passed it during the last election, but it was Vinbar that was elected in the end. Did she tell you about it? A little, but it is a secret trial. It is important that you give your whole heart to it. I know that you must choose your path in your way. Combat is not necessarily the best response, even if it allows you to get to where you are going. If you are confronted with animals, remind yourself that they must feed, and there are ways of altering food to make those who eat it fall into a deep and peaceful sleep. Hmm. Is that an idea that your mother used? It's clever. Thank you. Anything else? I must leave you. See you later. Siora, do you know anything about the trial that awaits us inside? My mother passed it during the last election, but it was Vinbar that was elected in the end. Did she tell you about it? A little, but it is a secret trial. It is important that you give your whole heart to it. I know that you must choose your path in your way. Combat is not necessarily the best response, even if it allows you to get to where you are going. If you are confronted with animals, remind yourself that they must feed. And there are ways of altering food to make those who eat it fall into a deep and peaceful sleep. Hmm. Is that an idea that your mother used? It's clever. Thank you. Look, they're eating the old carcass. 
If you poured some sleeping potion on it, they'd fall asleep. You were freezing and you had this empty stare. The water in the basin spoke to you, no? Yes. Exactly like the lightning struck tree. I was something else for a brief moment. Tell us. Visions like this are guides, a keys for the sacred rituals. I was in the sky. I was floating. Carried by the wind, and it was a cold feeling. I was high up, and it was getting colder and colder. I felt my blood freezing in my veins. I fell to the ground and spun slowly. And then the sun warmed me. Suddenly I bounced on the ground, and I was taken by the bubbling current of this creek. Then, just like before, the vision dissipated. And I was suddenly with you again. This stone is blackened. Eaten away. I think it's supposed to evoke death. This stone is adorned with the etching of a drop of water. Here this looks like a snowflake. The snow, this drawing looks like an infant. The drawing on this stone makes me think of fire. I'm certain. On this stone, the sun is visible. This stone bears the image of a storm, or perhaps the wind. Evidently, I shouldn't have lit this candle. I must have lit the candles in the wrong order. I must have lit the candles in the wrong order. <sighs> Evidently, I shouldn't have lit this candle. Evidently, I shouldn't have lit this candle. I must have lit the candles in the wrong order.
This must be the seal that Glendan spoke of. It looks like the silhouette of the mountain of Tirfredi. And a face is drawn within it. The spirit of the volcano. One of the faces of Enon Mil Frichtemann. Tear to mud on Almanawi. I congratulate you for passing the trial. Enter. And so you have returned. Can you tell me what the seal deep within the cavern brings into your mind? A face in the mountain of Tirfredi. Then you have seen the true face of the island when looking into her waters. And the island has seen inside you. You have given the blood of the animals that protected the entrance to the passage. You have chosen strength a first time. In choosing the path of silence, you avoided confronting the Dosantats. Finally, you have completed the ritual. And in so doing, the Guardian recognized you as a wise man. You choose to trust the way of rules and wisdom. It is a difficult path, but it carries generous fruits. The island has seen your intelligence and also your compassion. The friendship of Katasach towards you no longer surprises me. Am I authorized to encounter Enno Mil Frichtemann now? to present him with my request. If the High King agrees, yes. We shall not oppose that decision. Only a High King or High Queen is allowed to open the sanctuary. I warned you, your voyage is far from over. I suppose that I'm going to need to convince them as well. Where can I find them? I do not know. And I believe that it may be another trial on your path to find the one you seek. Is he hiding? Has he been captured? He disappeared several months ago. Since then, we have not heard from him. He was worried about the Renaixe. The last people to have seen him, I'm told, were the most important chiefs of the clans here at the council. There was Dedra, Blatnid, Ulan, and Dunkas. My mother, alas, can tell us nothing more. Yes. I heard about your loss, Siora. And the worst, Tirse. Morning is a difficult time to pass. And the worst, Tirse. Thank you, Glinda. Dedra is the mal of the clan of the Storm Warriors. You will find her in the village of Vedlug. I've already met her. She sent me to confront a guardian. That sounds like her. Ulan is the mal of the village of Vignamri near the coast. It is said that he welcomes the Renaixe. As for Dunkas, he leads the Vigigidor. He is the chief of the Earth Healers. His village is not very far from the Didekid and Nadagais. Very well. I will go and see them. Try to find this High King. Thank you, Glendad. Kwaawalamsek. I hope that you will find him.
Lieutenant, I demand an explanation. Tell us what is going on. We haven't heard anything about Lord Dorsey's condition in spite of our inquiries. We are extremely worried. And then, all of a sudden, one of his guards appears, shaken and on his own, though he is part of his retinue. Please, allow me the chance to shed some light, my lady. Your soldier is nothing more than a coward for abandoning his highness. Tell me, what is going on? This soldier has just reported in. He is asking for reinforcements. He believes that Lord Dorsey has been attacked. He believes? He ran here without full knowledge of what happened firsthand. I... I was sent on patrol far from the camp. But I heard screams. From men and from beasts. I wanted to return to camp, but then I heard a deafening sound. Grinding, like a landslide. I thought then it would be best just to go and get help. Thank you, Lieutenant. You are dismissed. I would like to have a discussion with this man alone. Yes, sir. My lady, could you lead these fine people into the hallway, if you would be so kind? Certainly. I deplore this embarrassing turn of events. But know that you have my full support in all circumstances. In the interest of avoiding a general panic, tell me precisely what happened back there. Your cousin ordered us to escort him beyond the town limits. The Islander convinced him to go on some journey. By Islander, do you mean the Denegad that came to treat his affliction? Yes. A, a strange bird. Missing more than one feather, you ask me, sir. I, I was ordered to set up patrol along a small path, rather far from the rest of the company. I was told to protect our perimeter from anyone wandering along. According to the Islander, it was the only access to their planned destination. I did my rounds for quite some time. Not a soul came along. But then I heard cries a ways off. And I went running to help. I heard an enormous crashing sound, li like an avalanche of rocks. So then I turned right back around. And you ran all the way here? Do you know precisely where the company was when you heard these sounds? No, not precisely. I hadn't gone there. But I could show you where I was posted. The Islander said they were following the path, but he was quite a ways ahead when I lost sight of them. Why didn't you go and look for yourself? To see if they had been buried by a rock slide? What? Alone? What could I have done? It seemed of greater urgency to go and get help. I'm still having trouble deciding if cowardice or intelligence got the best of you. But that's a question for your superiors. My cousin was quite weak. Do you know why he decided to follow the Denega? His Highness was feeling much better. The potions that he was drinking must have been potent. I mean to show no disrespect to his Highness, but that islander had the high ground in the War of Wits. I wasn't privy to their counsel. I haven't the beginning of an explanation for the expedition. That your cousin was all full of enthusiasm and ordered that we set out as quick as we could make ready. That sounds like him. What sort of mess has he gotten himself into? Again. I am sorry, sir. But I don't know anything else I could tell you. Dismissed, soldier. Looks like I'm going on an expedition. Thank you, sir. <laughs>